consider the seriousness of what you're doing? Yes. Sister, is there nothing we can do? Nothing. On this fateful autumn day, the nun called Sister Luke, under special and extraordinary circumstances, was released from all her vows. She took leave of her convent forever, because, in her own words, she was no longer a nun. Only afterwards did she reveal to the world her truly remarkable and very personal story. This is that story. As a book, The Nun's Story swiftly became the most gripping and dramatic bestseller of this decade. Now a tremendous motion picture, it pierces deep into the fascinating secrets of a seldom, if ever, seen world. Deeper into the pageant and violence of the teeming African Congo. And deepest of all, into the conscience of a young and beautiful girl. You will be assisting Dr. Fortunati. He is a genius and a devil. But remember, he is also a man, a bachelor, and I'm afraid an unbeliever. Don't ever think for an instant, sister, that your habit will protect you. You will search your memory in vain for motion picture excitement and entertainment to compare it with. There is no equal. There has never been a motion picture like The Nun's Story. <laughs> Father Mamelian will too. Religion hasn't made him tense and disciplined. The nun is a disciplined person. Yes, but not necessarily tense. As a surgeon, it's not my business to pry into the mind, but I'd say that tension is the sign of an exhausting inner struggle. Do you realize that every time you make me talk to you like this, I should go down on my knees before my sisters and proclaim my fault? <laughs> 